of the grade tenth. We are discussing political science in that seventh chapter, the outcomes of democracy. So, the today's subtopic of this chapter is how do we assess democracy outcome? So, in the ninth grade, you have learned some part of the democracy conversation of the democracy how it is a better how it is a best for the government when we are the comparing uh, dictatorship and the other any other alternative for to the to maintain and manage for the democracy we are the feeling the democracy is very, very excellent because of the different views and the benefits as well as the need of a citizens of a state or a country. So democracy is to make a people to representing in a part of the government. They are the making. They are people. They are. Uh, running the government they are representing of the government why because people the adult franchise they are electing a leader a head of the people state and a country that they are the part of a people they are the head of they are the choosing the person behalf of the themselves so benefits of the democracy they are the promotes the equality among the citizens they are the treat they are the everyone is equal everyone is uh, uh, there is no inequality and the all the citizens they are leading a life with a dignity the self respect is very important when they are the part of the democracy and they improve the quality of decisions making the the head of who the people they are choosing the person they are the part of the making the decision that is a part of them they are a benefiting or they are the uh, taking a decisions which is benefit for to the ordinary person and provides a method of resolve conflicts they are, we are the having to resolve the conflict in between a states in between a citizen in between the government or in between a government and citizens so they are the having the different methods of the resolving those disputes and conflict and they are the giving a chance to to solve the mistakes these are the related to the democracy when we will talk about the people around us they are a support for the democracy they it is a, a part of the people the rather than in alternative the different governments like a monarchy like a military or the other religious leader but in a democracy it is a part of the people you know that a uh, definition it was given by a person a great leader abraham lincoln by the people for the people and to the 
people that is a part of the democracy so it is make a people happy because the government it is itself run by the people and they are the having a satisfactory what it is in a present in a democracy as a practice there is no force the claim of a democracy it it uh, it should be it it is in a good principle excellent laws excellent rules and regulations they are the making a part of a people and they are the involving the outcomes of a democracy when we prefer this democracy we are the having a moral reasons behind of this democracy the support of the democracy it is a part of a government so when we see the practically the some countries around the world today they are claim and practice some kind of the democratic politics and they are forming or formal constitution by holding a uh, elections the participating and uh, generate the rights of a people or the part of a citizens the some are the common features we can see in the all type of the government and this democratics we are much different from other terms of their social solutions and their economic achievements and their culture when we see the achievement sometimes it should not be happened that achievement under the democracy we are the having so many difficulties in the in every democratic and it will be the happens and the democracy often pushes to make a position in the part of the government that is they are the addressing they are the giving uh, so much important that is uh, social economic and political development programs as well as to solve the problems in a society the sometimes we are the blaming will start a blame for the democracy why because the government what it is a promises when the election time or the sometimes what it will be give by the speech the by the document it unable to achieve so the people start blaming a democratic democratic government and it will be creates uh, some con- conditions for the achieving something and the citizens of uh, india or any other states they are the having advantages of conditions to achieve the goal and it is a responsibility of a citizens to give a respect to the government the all the organs of a government that is a legislature executive and judiciary so for the reference you can refer a 10th grade ncert test book thank you